So now you were one of the first people to buy into the Glass brand. It's doing well in views and following now. How do you feel like that can help the Virginia music scene? What do you feel like Glass TV is doing for the Virginia music scene? One thing I can say about Glass, the whole setup, yeah, all about business. Friendship, you know what I'm saying, that can happen come later. But as far as business side, you know what he's doing. He know how to market your shit. You know how to get in contact with people about certain shit if you have questions. You know what I'm saying, things like that. This man, like, yo, move around real good. And niggas hate on him for it. But other than that, he don't let none of that break him down. He still handle his business like a grown man. And he'll, he, like, Glass TV can help some people. Like, you know what I'm saying? He putting the shit out there. Like, he's constantly on there every day. Every day, moving around. Put posting something. It could be just random shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? He's making it known that he's about a shit. If your shit is on there catching the views that he's getting, he's going to get views regardless. Why not buy into it? So for the people that don't believe anything that Glass TV has to offer, what is something Glass TV done for, for, for you? Give me views. You know what I'm saying? People that, you know what I'm saying, are higher up than just the normal, basic rappers of people that are listeners. You know what I'm saying? Heard my shit before. You know, like, you don't never know who will see it. So, you know, as far as, like, being noticed by somebody that's just not ordinary like me, well, I'm not ordinary, but you, you get the point. Like, man, I'm getting out there because of my man, and why not invest in because of what? I'm putting money in because I know I'm going to get this shit going. You know what I'm saying? So now Glass TV has a lot of, I wouldn't say a lot, but we have celebrities following. We have a and R's now. We done built up a face card. Now, could you consider Glass TV a plug for the Virginia music scene? Damn right. Like you got to invest in niggas from your area and share in the glory and not say fandom, but like just the glory of getting out of Virginia with somebody from where you are that know your struggle. You know what I'm saying? Like, niggas need to invest in glass. Like, I can't put enough emphasis on that. Like, ain't on no dick riding shit. Like, this is some real shit. And I'm like, everybody got their specific people that they want to invest in. Fine, cool, we not talking about them. Invest in my nigga glass, yo. Like, this is coming straight from the <laughs> horse's mouth, dog. It's happening. So now this is one of my reasons for starting Glass TV. The Virginia music scene. What do you feel like needs improvement? Loyalty. Like niggas are, you know what I'm saying? Niggas be loyal. Niggas be loyal until, like, say, I right, say my man's this nigga get on. Like, we've been fucking with each other for like 15 years plus, you know what I'm saying? Exaggeration. And then, like, my man's get like a little break. Mind you now, I've been rapping and fucking with this nigga the whole time. I'm here, I'm here where he at. He at where I'm at, you know what I'm saying? But then, boom, he like, fuck everybody. That's more or less like, I ain't gonna say that's like what Chris Brown did, but you know what I'm saying? It's just like, niggas will say fuck where they from, you know what I'm saying? I'm here. I mean, I respect, shout out to all the niggas eating in Virginia, but it's just like, these niggas is just phony, you know what I'm saying? Like, niggas were together. I mean, I'm not gonna say everything is like it seems. Everything that glitters ain't gold, obviously, you know what I'm saying? Shit is real. I like, say all these Atlanta rappers. Now, you got... Migos, you know what I'm saying? They grew up with Skipper, Mango, all of these niggas. Now, when the Migos made they hit Versace, nah, I ain't even say Versace, Bando. Now, these niggas gaining all this fucking hype, jumping, getting all this shit right, then Versace hit, boom. White people on it, Drake on it, everybody on it, all across the world on it. The minute they got their money, they took all their niggas with them. Niggas around here ain't gonna do that. It, it don't fly like that. I don't care where you from. Northern Virginia. You from the NNK. You from the beach. You know what I'm saying? Anywhere like that. Don't get me wrong. Some niggas fuck with some niggas. But all niggas ain't gonna fuck with each other. And that's how I feel about it. It's, it's no loyalty. You know what I'm saying? Not it's more or less loyalty, but togetherness. You know? VA should be VA. So you saying Virginia likes unity? Fuck no. I don't like unity. I said lack. Oh, yeah, damn right. They lack the fuck out of unity. They like, 
niggas don't give a fuck. They say DMV this, DMV that. But you know what I'm saying? You don't support your local rapper. You don't really fuck with the singers like that. You know what I'm saying? You don't really fuck with the music scene. Niggas don't fuck with each other's music scene until it's like, all right, let me use this nigga T-Soul for example. My bad, excuse me. This nigga got on the voice. He didn't say where he was from. From the NK. All right. He from the NK. He said he was from Richmond. He spent a lot of time in Richmond, but he was from NK. Shit. Back when I was young, I went to church with this man. You know what I'm saying? I don't fault him for saying he's not from a specific area because most people didn't really support him. Like when he was passing out CDs places and shit like that. Niggas ain't giving up. Two, three dollars for the CDs and shit like that. But now this nigga on the voice in front of Alicia Keys and all them. Now you want him to say, oh, I'm from this area. Like, nah, fuck that. I don't blame you, man. I support you. Real shit. But, yeah. So now we can go, go over to, you mentioned Chris Brown. Now as far as unity or giving back, what do you feel he could do for Virginia? And they gave $100,000 to Houston for a hurricane, right? I ain't seen him call for $100,000 for Virginia yet. 